Welcome to Talk Show T, episode six. This is the Throwback Thursday, Talk Show T slash Omega Studio News. I'm your host, Kareem Clemens. Thank you so much for being here with me today. Here is April the 27th, 2017. It is a Thursday. This is episode six. I'm so excited. I am so happy that my viewers are here uh, viewing this uh, live Ustream, which is usually broadcast here on Ustream. The T. This is the T for today. Um, I'm just so uh, happy. Um, just a couple of updates. Um, I'll, I've been so busy because uh, I've been, I think I've been uh, having allergies, and you know, the weather is actually. Uh, you know, release and it's pollen and everything. So I'm just really, uh, really bad with my sinuses. So um, I skipped out and then now I'm here because I want to talk about some um, information, some tea, you know, here on Talk So Tea. I'm so excited that I'm here. I'm so excited that you're here. Please uh, feel free to uh, uh, chat in the chat room. Um, I will be, as I always do, I usually um, do the show, and then after the show, I will go ahead and chat with our um, viewers, so um, please chat away. We do have an set moderator, and that is ready to, let's see, ready to go ahead. So y'all go ahead and talk while um, I go ahead and discuss this tea for you today, okay? So, oh, okay, so before I start off with the uh, tea of the, of the day, okay, I want you to take a look at my background. I had to, you know, bring it, uh, spruce it out a little bit, put the, uh, put the lights that I have. I'm not really sure if this is how it's going to be, but, you know, I try to, um, I try to make it different all the time. As you noticed in the previous videos, I try to make the background uh, a little bit different, and I also try to have some guests on the show. As you see here, we have two, pre three previous guesses, and one new guest. This is a new guest, uh, one of the uh, teddy bears that um, that was in the um, the bag to be donated with the other ones, you know, with this one. But I refuse to donate them because they just so um, they're just the keeper. So yeah, so we have um, the teddy bear here. Um, we have Elmo back rocking the uh, the hat that I believe Miss Behind, but we don't want to call her that. And I was gonna do something about something with her eyes, but um, I just said I'll leave it like that, leave her name and everything the way it is. Right now she is sporting her hair. Her hairdo is uh, you know I'm sorry, um, her hair is not really all that. But, you know it's not done for the show. I had to catch off guard. Uh, so matter of fact, let's let have her. Look into the camera. Um, I think it's this way. Let's have her look into the camera. She wants to look into the camera, and she wants her hair um, not covering her her uh, her mold on her face, her mold on her face, and her colorful eyes. You know how you have the uh, oh, let's put it past his um his feet. Okay, he won't mind, right? He won't mind. Okay, and then we have her. Okay, so you said fix it a little bit. Oh, uh, you want to look right into? Okay, just, oh, she's definitely looking at y'all. She's, she's definitely, she's definitely looking. At you. you gotta look right there. Okay, there she go. Okay, and then we have Penguin. We have Penguin here, uh, checking out. He's um looking. He's looking that way. He's looking that way. I don't know he's over there. He's looking that way. Okay, so those, these are my guests uh, here for Talk Show Tea. Right here on this cozy Thursday, I'm so excited. This is episode six. I've been wanting to try to get all the episode, episode into episode ten, but um, again with the old um po pollen and everything, my sinus says that shouldn't be no excuse. But you know, sometimes you know, gotta do what it do, baby. All right. So yeah. So let me get with the program, the tea, the tea, the tea. Okay. So I at one point. Oh, okay. I at one point wanted to put an error here on Talk Show T uh, on the uh, Aaron Hernandez. Okay, I'm I'm just so over 
we're talking about that. But I do have some corrections and some more information and some breaking news. Okay, so correction. I do want to see a correction um, with this. In my previous episode, I had said something about the three letters that was found. One to the four-year-old, one to the fiancé, and another one to a gay lover. And then I said to a lover. Now I'm saying nothing. I, I'm taking back. Uh, the social media is saying that the letter was sent to his lawyer. Lover, lawyer, lover, lawyer, L, lawyer, L, love, ver. Okay, so, um, so yeah, so, um, the social media saying stop slandering Aaron Hernandez's name with the old gay thing and everything, so boom. Um, we don't know if he's gay or not, but, uh, the story, the T is that there was a, um, a letter um that right now social media is uh they're actually um talking about this lover who um Aaron Hernandez supposedly have been uh you know with and also have may have given him a watch which is a personal custom watch worth almost fifty thousand dollars to this uh man who who actually is on Prison Connect, which is the same, almost like the website that I use to talk to or correspond with men behind bars in the Department of Corrections. Okay, so his profile is up there. He has a Prison Connect profile up there. The man is allegedly supposed to have uh, there that that is or is allegedly supposed to be the uh, boyfriend of um, Aaron Hernandez. Also, in my last video um, episode, I said that um, there was a private funeral along with a private burial. Well, social media is saying that, um, and I had said also that we may um, know or probably locate the, where the body of uh, Aaron Hernandez is, but social media is saying, and Concho T is reporting, that Aaron Hernandez will be cremated, or he probably already has. Okay, so we don't have a body. We know right now that um, uh, Aaron Hernandez's body is being cremated. Also, the correction with the uh, the letter, it wasn't to a gay lover. It was to a lawyer. Okay, so T has uh, want to recant the on the uh, last episode. Also, um, the, the the guy who is in social media now is uh, has a profile on. Uh, Prison Connect, which uh, might spread some tea on revealing that um, tomorrow on Prison View, but let's stick with this, okay? So, um, so yeah, and uh, this watch that was allegedly given to this guy who actually uh, got it for him for a, um, a, 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 believe it, birthday present, and it was a custom-made watch. Uh, which is worth fifty thousand dollars. Also, the talk show T is is also um, revealing this information too. Um, that let's see. Okay, so breaking news is that um, the late Aaron Hernandez estate is worth zero. It's worth nothing. Okay, but social media is reporting that there is a. A, a offer on his estate, his home, his previous home, and the amount of $1.3 million. So if someone buys that house, that money will be uh, distributed in a silver suit case that was uh, uh, filed by the late victim, which was, he was found guilty in his first one, which was Odin Lloyd. The family sued, and I believe they probably got some money. So this money that is... Um, being sold for this home that uh, Aaron had, uh, he basically would have it. Um, they will actually give it to them. Okay, so that is it right now on the Aaron Hernandez case. Uh, we just found out breaking news here on social um, talk show T is that the the estate of Aaron Hernandez is worth nothing. Okay, and his body was cremated. And also, the letter was not the third letter was not to a gay lover; it was to a lawyer, and that the uh, the man or the person that they're saying is this 
the same person who received this gift of the watch with the, which is worth fifty thousand dollars he do have a profile with photos on prison connect okay so that is um that's it um here for the Aaron Hernandez uh yes next okay so um so yeah so I want to make another correction so um yes on my last episode episode five we had our guest president Barack Obama in the background and I had um I want to make a correction I had also had stated that uh, when I when I was talking about the 100 days in office, I was I said in a video um, President Barack Obama, but now I'm recanting or taking away and I'm correct correcting, and it's President Trump 100 days in office, and then pick up back to the other episode. Okay, so yeah, so I made a, I'm making a correction here. It wasn't President Trump. It was President. I mean, it wasn't President. Barack Obama, it was President Donald Trump, who uh, 100 days had just passed on um, Earth Day, Saturday. Okay, so yes, um, so um, that's um, that's the tea. Okay, next. Okay, so I want to talk about um, the special viewing that I'm putting together for May 1st, and it is uh, basically a um, uh, life and death uh, uh, for uh, Chris Kelly, the late Chris Kelly. He is the uh, one of the members of Criss Cross. If you recall, uh, the 90s rap disc Criss Cross, um, you know, he came into the spotlight in 1992 and he's uh, been um, uh, 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 founded by or spotted by uh, music and producer Jermaine Dupri. We all know him. After he uh, discovered the pair at a local mall somewhere in Southwest Atlanta. Okay, so um, if you recall, uh, Chris Kelly, he um, on May first, in two thousand thirteen, Kelly was found unresponsive in his home. He uh, died on that day, May 1st, uh, 2013, at the age of 34. They are saying that um, he was unresponsive in the living room, on the living room couch in his Atlanta home, and that people tried to resuscitate him, but they was unsuccessful. And also, um, at that time, as we know him as Mac Daddy, was dead. Okay. Later, it revealed that, um, well, later the Fulton County Medical Examiner revealed toxicology screening that the late Chris Kelly, known as Chris Cross, had a mixture of drugs, including cocaine and heroin, in his system. So I will be doing a special light on him because I know back in the 90s, uh, you know, he was the, 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 the peoples of the music, okay? So, um, and I know everybody, um, Loved his uh, song, Chris Carson, make you jump, jump, Mac Daddy, make you jump, jump. Hey, hey. Okay, so we're going to have um, a special on that marking four years of his death, which is Monday. That's May 1st. So please stay tuned. That's on Talk Show T, which will be on May 1st, Monday. Okay. Next. The Best is yet to come. I love waiting for the best flags. Okay, so yes, yeah, so um, before I start with the prison view, um, I do want to um talk about the uh the web websites uh, slash blog page. Okay, so I have been in contact with the moderator. I have a couple of updates. Okay, so. Okay, so we have, um, there is a update for our, from our moderator. Okay, in regards of, this is, this is coming from the moderator for the Yahoo group and also um, the uh, Facebook community fan page. Okay, so from our moderator, email set in saying that we are working very, very hard and very tirelessly to try to switch everyone switch everyone over from the Yahoo group 
to a Facebook account. He also stressed the fact that it is very hard for him to try to do that when a lot of people are not responding to him and some of them some of the members don't even have Facebooks okay some people still have the Yahoo sorry it, the 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 phone had uh, picked up on my voice command. okay so they had um, Yahoo and you know once when that happened uh, no one switched over okay so he's saying the moderator is asking that everyone please be patient they are he is still on the investigation with the breach that happened with the Yahoo where everybody email was hacked so um, he, we do know that he had uh, the moderator has sent out a lengthy letter to all the members stating that if you have a password please change it and make it very sensible only you know it okay he is saying that but he is still encouraging everyone to switch over to the Facebook so everyone can be a part with the Omega Studio News and also with Talk Show T. Okay, so that is a letter from the moderator, but in the same way, the group page is still being updated to this day by the moderator. And any information, please uh, uh, email the moderator, or you can email Talk Show T, and uh, it will go out too. Or you can go out. You can go to the Omega Studio News uh, blog page, and you can go to contacts, and you can put in the subject the uh, you know the moderator and Daquan Jones, and you can uh, put the message, and then it will go to the email. Matter of fact. This email that we have uh, connected to the blog page, I have made it to where it has their email connected to the server to where any information that will go in it will not be just forward to me. It will be forward to the moderators of the Yahoo group and also the Facebook community page. Okay, so this is an email from the moderator. It is just basically talking, giving an update on the Yahoo page, and I mean the Yahoo group as well as the breach that happened with Yahoo. Okay, so uh, the talk show team wants to give a shout out to Al, Al Nicholson and also Daquan Jones who are based in Los Angeles, California. They volunteer their services for the Omega Studio News, and not only that, they volunteer their service for Talk Show T as well. They have been a, um, they have been part of the community and part of the show ever since. And the Omega Studio News, along with me, would like to take this time to shout out on Talk Show T, Al Nicholson and Daquan Jones, for a great job. Thank you so much guys for doing an awesome job, <clears throat> doing an awesome job and becoming volunteers here for Omega Studio News and Talk Show T. Thank you so much. I love you guys. Thank you so, so, so much. This is for you guys. Thank you so much, man. I really appreciate it. I do remember, I, um, I'll talk a little bit about that. I do remember I got an email from Daquan and it was just like I was just so shocked. It was when I had the Omega Studio News up. It was up when it was www.omegastudionews, and I had got an email. That, I think it was my the fifth email that I had got from the um, the Omega Studio News webpage. Okay, so when I seen this email from him, I'm reading it and I'm like, somebody wants to volunteer with me. They wants to volunteer with me on the Omega Studio News. So I, and 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 at that time, and you can see from the videos that I have done on YouTube, that I was just now starting. I was just now putting Omega Studio News together. I was just now doing everything: the Twitter, the blog page, uh, getting Omega Studio News out there. Then having the website. So yeah. So once and I knew that, then I just thought about it. And I was like, you know, what, I really do need someone to help me with the Omega Studio News webpage. So I emailed him back, and then next thing you know, it was like the next morning I have received 
I think it was three emails that I received, and all of them was like, uh, I am willing to volunteer for the Omega Studio News. Uh, would you please um, um, contact me? I can be the moderator. I can do something. Just use me where you need. And I emailed them back, and then I called them on the phone, based out in Los Angeles. And then next thing you know, he said he had a friend who was looking to um, follow in the same foot. And I'm like, wait a minute. I'm like, people really want to do this. And I'm like, this is this can't be really happening. So he had a friend who actually, and that's Al, uh, he actually um, contact me and I got his information and both of them, he worked with him, worked with, you know, we all work together. So all three of us, we are actually, the they are actually with the Omega Studio News and also Talk Show T. So thank you guys so much. Talk Show T, love you guys. Thank you so much for your excellence. Thank you for your brilliance. Thank you for your, your talent. Thank you for your service. Now that's public service, people. That's public service. Thank you so much, man. Shout out to Al Nicholson and Daquan Jones all the way in Los Angeles, California. Thank you, man. Thank you, thank you, thank you. From Talk Show T. Okay? So yes, so um so yes, yeah, so that is um, the email from the moderator of um, talk, talk, um, of the Yahoo group. Also, um, I did have, um, there was a note that I had wrote down. I do have Al, I'm just trying to find it. Okay, so I do wanna say that um, in May, I wanna make this breaking news, and this is Ustream, this is the, uh, web page that we do the breaking news on. I do want to say that um, the Omega Studio News will be coming back to social media. Social media. Omega Studio News went dormant a couple of weeks ago, but I'm telling you now that the Omega Studio News will be back on Facebook. The community page will be up and running. Uh, give me another week. And uh, have a new brand new video coming out. New brand new video. It actually talks about, um, it actually shows, let alone talk about, it actually shows and talk about uh, perhaps the danger of what bloggers like me go through. When you're trying to get the tea on some scoop, you understand, and you know, you faced in reality, but. I want to show this video to y'all to show you what really happened, okay? And you guys put it together. It's I'm just going to put it out there, okay? This video will show you the cause, the cause, and it will show you the effect. It will show you the action to the reaction, okay? It's going to show life or death, okay? That's how serious this video is. I have it prepared. Omega Studio News is coming back to social media soon. Please stay tuned. The community page is up. Also, I do want to make take this time out to say that the blog page that is under kareemclemens.wixsite.com slash talkshowt, that website will be soon disconnected. Tomorrow is the last day that that website will be up. Okay? After tomorrow... That website will be discontinued. Okay, the kareemclemens.wixsite.com slash talkshowt. That website will be discontinued tomorrow. Okay, the reason why I say that is because I do have, which was the Omega Studio News, now it's the Wix um, blog page. Um, you guys know the marking, the bookmark. That page will soon has a have a tab on it that will say talk so T TV and you go to that tab and you press it and it will show you all everything including this video right here talk show T TV tab and you will see it and it will take you to all the videos including this one it will have messages from our representative which is uh, and you can go on um, Twitter to uh, talk to the representative of Talk Show T, and or you can um, talk to them via Talk Show T TV tab. 
So all the videos will be there. I am also working with trying to get H, I think it's HTML through this, through the, uh, through the page, so that when this video go live, the video will go live on the web page on talk show talk show TTV and if and it will just be uh, used through either a service or uh, maybe Ustream so every time I go Ustream it will connect to there I'm, I'm, I'm putting trying to put it together so talk show T TV is the tab and you will just press that and it will lead you to all the episodes including this one and then at the bottom of it you will have ways to contact basically everything you've seen on the uh, the the talk show T uh, blog page so everything that you see on there it will basically be on the talk show TV the talk show T TV tab along with the episodes messages from our representatives represent uh, messages from people who may want to leave testimonies uh, some of our viewers here it, it would be uh, very cool to have chat going on <clears throat> chat going on while the video is going on live okay so coffee as usual but this time I had put marshmallows in it yes coffee with marshmallows Okay, so yes, um, so yes, so uh, that is the T, the T talk show blog page of you guys have will be discontinued tomorrow, and the page will go on the tab on the Omega Studio News blog page. You just go down to the, 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 the tab and then you press the talk show T TV tab. And it'll take you to all the episodes, including this one. And again, uh, you know, messages from the representative, messages from people who want to send testimony. Any questions, comments, any uh, you want to anything you want to see on talk show T, uh, what background you want for talk show T, and also soon uh, you can use that contact information to contact. Talk show T for any corresponding information when Prison View, because that is the time right now to talk about Prison View, which is going to be happening on our Super Freaky Fridays. <laughs> Super Freaky Prison Fridays, guys. Super Freaky Prison View Fridays. Okay? So, yes, as I've been telling you, I'm finally happy to be on this last topic. Okay? So, here on episode 6, Prison View is coming tomorrow. I have a whole lot, basically half of the, the, the damn uh, video tomorrow is going to be about Prison View. Okay, because there's so much god darn it stories happening in the god darn Department of Corrections. is unbelievable across our country. Whew. People is being executed. It is happening. They are not playing. They are not playing. There is a drug that is soon to be expire uh, the 29th of April 2017. And they are dropping people like it's like they flies. Okay. So, yeah. So, a couple of people. Um, I have the T on who's been executed, who's up for execution. I have the T on some um information with the tax going on that's happening in our prisons today and also sad information i will have where a correction officer lost her life in a line of duty in the department of corrections somewhere in our country okay and i will also see if be still checking the mail and see if any letters came we don't have um, right now there is no letters no letters yet but soon they will be here. Soon they will be here and talk so D will share the tea on the people who are locked up. Okay? So yeah, so um so yeah, talk show tea is that tomorrow, so I will have the scoop on that. 
Um, also, I'm going to check tonight to see if the uh, the JP is working. So if it is, um, I'm going to see if I can correspond with some people and see if um, I can email them and they can email me back and we can get something out here in, situation, in the situation room. So basically what Prison View is, for those who don't know and for the record, Prison View is a part of here on Talk Show T where me, the host, get to talk about the inside world of the inside world. Basically talk about what happens in prison. Okay, what happens in prison and I also I also want to say that here on Torture T, we do not, we do not forget about our brothers and sisters who are locked up in the Department of Corrections here in this country. Okay? We stress the fact that People here in the department and the correctional needs TLC, which is tender, loving care. We love them here on Talk Show T. I love them. Okay, brothers and sisters out there. Okay, so on Prison View, what I have done is is that on the in the social media network, I've actually taken the time out to write some men and women, gay, straight, bisexual, transgender, and questioning. To see if they would like to talk to me, and I told them who I am. I told them that I am a blogger, and I uh, do videos on Ustream and on Mega Studio News, and that if you would like to give a shout out to some people and want to talk to me and get a little story out on here on Talk Show Tea, or you have some tea to be spilled um, that's going on in jail, let us know. Like, let us know what's going on. Like, you know those little kites that y'all be. Uh, um passing how do y'all make it or y'all how do you how do you go to the bathroom when you have another cellmate you know and then you have um uh, some people i wrote who are lifers and some people who are in death row you know how does it feel who do you like to talk to what would you like to get your, your point across i'm asking for all Okay, what are you going to be thinking about the day they say you're going to die tomorrow? You know, um, Talk Show T Prison View wants it all, man. Um, life term people, uh, some information on how do you do a bid, how does this affect you, your family. You understand, as a man, what's going on in the jail, what's the, the prison slang? Okay, for those guys who have been locked up 23 and 1, how does it feel? What do you do in that solitary confinement cell? Talk Show T wants it all for prison view here on Talk Show T. Okay, so I'm going to try to get as much information as possible. Again, there has not been any letters that are in the mail right now, but I can say that I have written uh, five, five letters out to somewhere of in the Department of Corrections in our country, so hopefully we get some we get some uh, corresponding and response back from those men and women because it was both. Okay, I would love to share that story. What is appropriate? What is not appropriate? But you know, and then I have a special uh, revealing. So I did say in the Aaron Hernandez case that the so-called guy who, you know, Aaron supposed to have been talking to and left his watch for he does have a profile on prison connect and i will um i will i will i will show y'all through the phone okay i'll show y'all what it looks like okay it's already on social media but on talk show t is already out there so why not show it you haven't seen it okay so yeah so that is for the 28th friday Okay, and I actually uh, told you guys about this special on May 1st. There's no special event that I know of on uh, Saturday or Sunday. I'm um, going to try to see if uh, the weather's supposed to be nice. I'm going to try to see if I can go out and get some more um, more videos and pictures of the, the earth. And then try to, because uh, you know, I'll be... I don't know. I, I had took a video today of a squirrel trying to. I didn't even have no peanuts in my hand, and I had a video that um, that the squirrel was trying to eat. Eat. I was trying to rub the squirrel. Tell you the truth. But um. But yeah. So um. Also too um. I do want to say this too. 
that I what what I have started doing, and, and you've probably already seen this already previously. Um, I have started like pre-recording certain things and then using my uh, the iMovie to add some effects and stuff in it. So, <clears throat> so what I've been doing is what I wanted to do is is I wanted to uh, do that video first and then put the video out there because it seems like the video this video is being put out there first before that video. It's just basically a recording of me um, of this show, a little bit about what's happening and you know what people are expecting to uh, for the show. But what I have the privilege of doing, which I can do it, I can look at the video, and then I can go ahead and uh, do those edits, and then I can publish it and then I can save it, or I can just do mad videos, however I want to do it. But um, you know, but this is the video for today, okay, in the episode six. Okay, so without further ado, here on Talk Show T, I want to take this time out to thank our guests. Okay. Our guests. Okay, he's. I'm gonna face him that way now. Okay. 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 Thank our penguin. You want to put the glasses down there and see your eyes? There we go. Okay. Thank the penguin. Okay. Thank the penguin. Thank Behinds. Well, that's the name that she came in with. We're going to change her name eventually. And uh, we're going to do something with her hair. Oh, okay. So, thank Elmo. He's rocking the HM hat, HMM hat that she had on the other day. And thank our Stuffy right there, um, who is new to the group. And uh, our wonderful background with the lights and beautiful New York City. Okay, so thank you so much. This is episode six. I'm so excited. And please join me on episode seven, which is going to be on Friday, the 28th. Okay, and uh, without further ado, so what I normally do is I usually stop the broadcast and then I'll, use, I'll chat with the, um, the people who are in the chat room. Okay, thanking them for being a part of the show. Okay, so thanks a lot, guys. I'll see you guys in the next video. Take care and be well. Okay, thank you. And uh, stay tuned uh, for this video to be uploaded to YouTube. Also, um, for our people, people who are, people who are in the, um, the viewer room. Please stay there. Uh, I'm on my way. I'm going to be uh, ending this right now.